Th thank you, Mr. Chairman. And um, I, I guess I would make this point. Data travels in interstate commerce. It's not contained in a particular state. Um, and consumers deserve a very high level of privacy protection. This committee knows that better than anyone else. Wherever they live, wherever they work, wherever they travel. Um, and, and that's what a comprehensive privacy law would do. And, and look, I ha we should give Californians and the California legislature a lot of credit because they were the first state legislature to show us that um, lawmakers can pass, pass a law that protects consumer privacy. But your data minimization isn't in the California law. Uh, your limits on sensitive data uh, by default, not in the California law. Uh, the, dis the prohibitions on discriminatory use of algorithms, not in the California law. The prohibition on targeted advertising uh, to children, not in the California law. So um, it, 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 it's, 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 um, it's almost like we're comparing apples and oranges. We need a federal law. Your federal law is stronger than any state law or your federal proposal. And I would just urge you uh, to, uh, to move forward with it as I know you want to. Thank you very much, sir. I appreciate it very much. I couldn't agree more. Uh, Mr. Gregg, I appreciate you traveling across the country to be here. Uh, your testimony on the collection and use of what is fundamentally your data is insightful, uh, not just as a Hollywood creator, but also as an everyday American. Uh, I'd like to discuss another important element of, our, of your efforts, which is the need for better security of our data. We know these large AI systems harvest and scrape the internet for data, and that includes personal information due to the data breaches and hacking amongst other causes. Uh, this can be used for deep fakes and other scams that I will call digitized fraud. And the question is, how have you and the general public been harmed by this data being exploited and used for purposes that it wasn't intended for because there wasn't enough security around it. And I know you gave some examples, but if you could elaborate on that, sir, I'd appreciate it. 